In the 1960s and 70s, musician Sonny Bono was a household name. With hit songs like I Got You Babe on the radio and the Sonny and Cher show on TV, he and his wife Cher were the showbiz power couple of the day, reinventing what it meant to be an entertainer. Tell me, old fortune teller, will I receive great wealth? You are short. <laughs> when a public and bitter divorce battle divided the couple and their business, Bono had one of the most incredible second acts in Hollywood history. He became a U.S. congressman. But when a sudden and tragic accident took his life at age 62, his estate became a legal battleground. Bono died without a will, which set the stage for his wife and children, his world-famous ex, and a mysterious man making an astounding claim all grappling over their share of his $2 million fortune. When Bono passed away, there were many unanswered questions. Did he have a will or trust? Who would oversee his estate? And who did he leave his fortune to? Husband and wife attorneys and media experts, Danielle and Andy Mayoris, uncovered the truth behind the legal fight for Sonny Bono's fortune. It was a legal horror story. Show me. 